corner here. I'm standing in front of my 08 Malibu. And I was asked the question, does the oil life monitor on these GMs, does it really work? So far, with every oil change I've done on this car, I've went by what the monitor says, and it's roughly uh, about 12 to 13,000 kilometers that I get between oil changes, and that's when my oil monitor is saying that I need an oil change. So GM devised this, uh, and it monitors your driving habits and driving conditions, so I believe that the newer engines should go farther between oil changes because they do run that much cleaner. Going to see in just a minute how exactly how dirty and how filthy the filter and the oil is and see if the oil lost any viscosity. Check it out. Anyway, so the car's got 112,000 kilometers on it right now and There's my oil life monitor, 9%. So let's see what the oil looks like. So that's the oil coming out of it right now. It uh, looks pretty black, but we'll see how slippery it still is. So I've loosened it off with a uh, wrench. That's all I ever use on these. I guess there's a tool you can buy, but so far I've been able to get by with using a wrench in there. Unscrew it, and out she comes. Okay, so have a good look at that filter here. So, looking at this filter, I would say that uh, the oil change was due, but not overdue. Gonna pull the drain pan out from under the car here. And there's the oil. Still feels very, very slippery. It's a nice close up view here of what it looks like. I mean, it's a little bit on the black side, but. Uh, sure is slippery still. The last filter I used was a Fram and I went out and bought a Wix filter. The first thing that I noticed aside from this one being used is that uh, this one has more ribs in it than the Fram so this Wix looks like it's put together a whole lot better. There's a little more money, but I'm going to try this one next, this time. So I've just filled it back up with oil again, and according to my manual, it says to put 4.7 liters in, and this is a 5 liter jug, so I've left a tiny little bit in the bottom. So I've got the car running here for a little bit. Just checked it over for some leaks and look, all looks good. So just to recap, I have faith in the GM oil monitor. I will keep changing the oil when it says it's due. Uh, the warranty covers anything as long as you uh, change it when the oil monitor says. So if they trust it, then I trust it as well. Uh, what I didn't like was the pram filter, the way it was all pink and crinkled. And I do like the Wix filter because it has more ribs in it, so we'll see what that one looks like when it comes out. So there's just one more thing left to do, and that's to reset the oil monitor from the inside. And if you want to see how to reset the oil monitor, the link is up here. If you want to see how to do an oil change, I'll also put the link up here. Enjoy, and thanks for watching.